everybody. Today I'm doing a resin painting on a round board. Um, they're really popular right now. Everybody seems to want one. So that's my choice for today. And I mixed my resin up uh, for three minutes, one to one. And I am using today, because I am out of my art resin, I am using East Coast Epoxy, which is like a quarter of the price, but it's only 20 minute working time. So you have to work quick. Not real quick, but you have to work quicker than you do with art resin. Art resin actually is 45 minute work time or 40 minute work time, and so you have a lot more room to play. So I mixed this up, I mixed it for three minutes. The colors I am using today are Black Diamond Pink Pearl, Maple Honey Dew, and these are all really shimmery. Liquid fire. Of course, my favorite. Gotta have gold. Gold, gold, gold. And white. Okay, so I'm going to mix them up because I am doing this for a lady who commissioned me to do all pinks. All pink. Pink, pink, pink. So we're just going to put these in the cup. I love gold. Of course, y'all know that by now, right? That I love my gold. And this one's pretty. This um, maple honey do. It looks like a penny. Like the color of like a copper penny that's brand new. And my black diamond white. So, I don't know if you guys ever seen these in person or just on videos and pictures, but these actually shimmer so pretty when the sun hits on them. It's just such an amazing effect, but you do, really truly can't see it that good in the video or in pictures. So, every cup I'm just going to fill uh, probably around about the same amount. Now, this board is 24 inches around, and I primed it with, um, actually, I got wood primer. I'll let you know what it is in a second when I'm done this. More white. That's white. And I'll just dump that. Okay. I bought this at Home Depot. It's called Gibson Gripper. White primer and sealer. Um, it bonds to walls, wood, masonry, whatever. But it really does seal this up pretty good because I used house paint and primer before and I had to put like four coats of it because whenever you work with pine, it, you keep getting these little bubbles unless you seal it up super good. So that stuff, I, I put a coat on and it sealed it up pretty good. So hopefully I won't see no bubbles. So I'm gonna put my face mask on while I stir this up, just because these little particles fly all over the place. This is my copper penny brown, well, what, what was it called? Maple honey dew. So it's not copper. The other color's copper. Okay, well, I don't know. It's like a ruddy brown. I don't know what it is. I guess it's a maple leaf dew. <laughs> That's what they called it. It's pretty. Okay, I'm going to mix these up, and I'll be right back. Okay, I have all my colors mixed up. I have the white, the maple brown or wait maple honeydew 
the pink, the magenta, that's what I'm calling them, and gold. Okay, so I am I put a little bit of clear on here, just a little bit that was left in the cup, and I'm just going to smear it around a little bit. Okay, my magenta first, then my pink. Hope I made enough color. Looks like I'm pushing it. And my honey, maple honeydew. I like this color, it's pretty, pretty different, huh? It's something to break up the pink. It's, Oh my goodness, there's dog hairs everywhere. Wow, there really is. Guess we'll put some there, huh? Gotta have me some gold. Now, all these are going to blend in together anyway. I'm going to blow dry them out and blend them in. So nothing has to be perfect. Nothing has to be set in stone. You do whatever you're feeling. Whatever you're feeling, you do. And finally, my white. Now, I might actually... Make up a little bit more of that maple honeydew. I think it needs to be a little bit darker, but we'll see what it looks like after I blow dry it out. I don't want to say I'm going to do something because I'm seeing it now. Okay, that's it. Look at that. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Okay, I'm done. No, I'm joking. Okay, so I'm... I'm Okay, so um, after looking at the camera and looking at this, I wasn't happy. So I mixed up some more colors. I mixed up acrylic paint with this this time. I used um, pink folk art paint, some cheap acrylic paint that I picked up. Okay, it's pink. I mixed it in with the resin and this is what happens. It's like marshmallow. I hate it. That's why I personally do not ever, hardly ever, use acrylic paint in my resin because look at it, it's really like marshmallow. It's thick and gooey. Just to let you know, not my favorite thing in the whole world to use, that's for sure. But everybody has what they like. This is just something I don't like, but I didn't have the pink that I, I didn't have, I wanted to add a little bit something different, like a different pink to the, to the paintings, that's why I did what I did. That. And 
magenta. I call it magenta. I think they call it like a liquid fire. But I call it magenta, so that's my magenta. Liquid fire, baby. Liquid fire. Okay. I think I'm losing my mind. And that maple honey dill. It's like a brown almost. Almost. Okay, now I'm going to That pink is thick, very thick. It's even hard to move when I, when I do this because it doesn't want to flow very easily. But Okay, so I had to fast forward through my blow drying because my video was too long. And for some reason, YouTube is only letting me put on 15 minute videos. I don't know if anybody else is having that problem, but I know I am. So I will be cutting out a lot throughout this video, unfortunately. a little bit more pink over top of the white to make it look like the white's just not sitting on top you know it needs a little bit of dimension there a little bit I'm just blow dry this one piece out I like it a little bit better, not much. <laughs> but um, my view, I like a lot. Your view, I'm not loving. So I'm gonna take the camera down and show you for real this time. Okay, so it looks better at this angle, right? I think so. Anyway, if you liked my video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I'm gonna show you up close. It's pretty crazy. I covered up most of the gold. Don't know why. I wish I didn't. There's little bits of gold coming through here and there, but I like it. I think it's pretty. Let me know your thoughts on it. You can be honest. Thanks for watching. See you next time.